Hello, I'm Jerome Pin and welcome back to Surrounded. We're of course in the last one we went down to the airfield and we got an absolute truckload of loot from there. Uh, we got four horde beacons I think in total so I'm going to trigger a few of those off today. Uh, we're going to have to redesign the defences but in between the episodes there has been an update and there's been a few twiddles and tweaks. I think there's some new clothing. There's also this... Uh, where are we down here? Uh, the shipping container for large storage capacity. So if you're running out of storage space, uh, you can now build a shipping container. But it does take 400 scrap metal, so ouch. But um, yeah, be it, we'll have to build one of those at some point and see how much we can actually get in there. But there's also, which is the most interesting to me, I think, is that this over here, if you place down foundations over rocks or trees that you've mined, they will not grow back. Um, but if you remove the foundations and then reload, they will grow back because I've tested both. And I pulled these up and then reloaded it. And there's two trees. There's like one somewhere around here and then there's one over here as well. Um, so that means you can now build wherever you like. Come over, come over here, chop all the trees down, put down your house, put down your buildings and um, that will delete everything. So that is great, but as I say, if you pull everything up, it will grow, regrow the tree, so that's fantastic. So I think next episode, we'll probably go and start building a house somewhere. Still kind of in favour of building over there. Hmm. I'm not too sure. I've marked a few places on the map. Uh, this place would be ideal, but it's just a little bit too hilly. But now that we can just chop the trees down and they disappear... That could mean that we some of these spots, like maybe we could build on a hill or something. I don't know, but that's for the next episode. Um, I think, though, what we need to do first, I'll just put this storage box over here with a load of the barbed wire in. And then we've got those horde beacons. Uh, we've got three of these, and then obviously we've got the one that we have to power ourselves. Uh, I did also make some of these traps, which I don't think are going to be very good, but I was just kind of curious, you know, for science, let's do that. So I think really... Uh, well, let's just run out here. I'm going to do the same again and defend um, on this uh, tower. I think that worked out well. We're behind that wall. If we kind of put the barbed wire like out here, maybe like three, like one there, one there. Maybe we'll take those foundations up. If we do that and then do like a second row, yeah. Maybe like two rows, not too far apart. Although, hmm, actually I want them a bit closer because I'm going to use the shotgun. So uh, my plan is to use the shotgun because I've got like hundreds of rounds for it. Um, like three or four hundred rounds easily. Probably, probably double that to be honest. I don't know how many I've got. But yeah, so I figured let's use the shotgun on this one. So I think if we do like a couple of close rows like that. And then I've built a ton of mollies as well. Um, I used up all the alcohol that was scavenged in the last few days. And I've got, yeah, about 16 molotovs I've managed to make. So if we molly, molly these guys and they get caught on the barbed wire. And then obviously we've got the uh, guns to shoot them up as well. But I just figured I'd place these down just for the why nots. Um, I don't know how effective they're going to be or what. But just put them down because they'll run into those hopefully. And then, oh, this thing. Oh, hang on. No, I need to... Yeah, I don't think that's going to be very good, but we'll give it a go. Actually, it might want to be out the front there. I don't know. Should we pull that up and just move that? Yeah, let's move that. I wonder if that'll be better over here, because it is just a pole with a wire wrapped around it, isn't it? So... I don't know. Let's try that there, shall we? And then let's get the guns. We'll kind of move those a little bit forward. And then I don't have many of those, but, we, you know, it is what it is. Uh, let's drop a bunch of that stuff in there for the moment. And then we can grab all of those. Uh, is there another one? I thought I... Yeah, there we go. Got three of those powered guns. Because um, they kind of ran in and they weren't able to shoot. So I think if we kind of put them around here... Hopefully this bush is not going to get in the way. Put like a bunch of the guns there. I mean, you could even put one on there, couldn't you? Yeah, why not? Let's 
put one there. And then I do have some concrete. I guess I could make some concrete as well. Uh, let's put that... Ooh. Do you know what? Let's pull that one up. Because uh, the that turret needs to be powered. And I think the power kind of stretches to around here somewhere. So if we put that there, it might just be okay. So if we put these three guns here, they might be a bit too close together. But we'll put it in there. I don't know if the bush is going to make a difference on that one. And then we put that there. Like so. And then let's go and just grab those concrete blocks. I don't think I've got any more. I'll have to go down and check. But I don't think I've got any more of those. And then we kind of try to defend these as best we can. But I could make some more uh, concrete blocks. Because I have got a little bit of that. So let's just put one in front of each for the moment. So, and then what do we need to make those? Obviously a load of cement, but it's a lot, isn't it? I forget how much it is, but it's a lot. So, uh, let's have a look. Where are you? There. Eight, and we need some metal as well. I could probably make a couple of those. I mean, they're just sitting here, so we might as well use them. Thirteen, is that all I've got? Oh, I could probably just make two. Yeah, <laughs> insane how much they cost. Um, I'll have a quick shifty through here before we start as well. I don't think I've got any more though. I think that's it. But uh, oh, hang on, I've ran past it. Well, it doesn't really matter. There's a crafting bench out the front, but uh, never mind. Let's do that. Let's, oh, I need the iron. All right, well, let's just go out there anyway. Uh, let's grab that. I could put some fences, I guess. Hmm. What if they can shoot through the fences, though? That's the question. I would assume not. Uh, where are we? Let's make like two of those. That's all we've got enough materials for, but that's fine. Let's plop those down, and then if we put that there, so I barricade that off like that. That's all I've got, and then I've got a bunch of fences. I wonder if they can um, can attack through those fences. I don't think they can, though. Do you know what? Let's go and see whether that gun is in the right range. Let's go and switch the generator on here. It's still got plenty of fuel in that thing. It's fine. Yep, that gun's working. That one's all working. I'm kind of thinking, I just think, let's do this. I'm going to use the shotguns, as I say, because I've got tons of ammo for them. Um, but we may we may go and grab some of the others. Uh, let's just... I think I'll just quickly chuck a save down. So I'm going to use two straight away, which probably isn't the best idea. Um, you're probably better off doing it... Um, let's take that as well. Uh, one at a time so you can grab all the loot. But, eh, where's the fun in that? Let's, let's do two and see what happens, if we can. I'm going to put a save down just in case... Um, it deletes the other beacon or something like that, and you can only have one at a time going. Okay, I've got it saved, and we'll put those beacons out there just in case this doesn't work. We've got to save, but I'm going to move these things. And I was thinking maybe moving the wire a bit closer as well, because why not? Rather than having a gap in between, I think maybe that's a good idea. Um, I'm thinking uh, being able to loot these things is probably going to be extremely difficult, looting these uh zombies and you're probably better off not doing this but eh, for science we got to do it so let's do it for science let's go we'll put that there it might be a bit too close and then we'll put that down say on this side here stopping that and then yeah i don't think that's going to be much use but we'll stick that there as well kind of block them off a bit uh, here on, let's just deal with these clowns first, shall we? Let's go there. Ow! Did... Did my gun shoot me? I gotta watch that back. Did the gun shoot me? Huh. Alright, well that's definitely gonna be an issue. <laughs> if I get shot by my own guns, what the hell? Alright, so 
Let's kind of put this... Oh, hello. Uh, yes. Yes. No! Don't! Stop shooting me! So, yeah, the guns shoot... Great. So you get shot by your own gun... Really? Okay, alright, there we go. So, yeah, looting is going to be kind of impossible, isn't it? So if we put one there... And then, yeah, if we put one, say... There. Activate that one. And then, yeah, we're activating that one. Alright. Let's go. So, yeah, we got to... Mm, yeah, I don't think the setup's going to work. I mean, looting's going to be difficult anyway with two beacons. Um, but... Yeah, I'm not going to be able to go out there. I wonder if I can jump through this thing. All right, well, let's see if this works. It's kind of a moot point until... 10 seconds. Yeah, both dishes are moving. Okay. That's good. We have dish movement. Wave 1 begins. Yeah, they're dropping down. And then the next one should drop in. Um... That spawn too. I think so. It's hard to tell, isn't it? Oh wow, that thing has five. Oh, all right, that's terrible. That has like five. Should can I jump through there? I can. But I haven't got very long to loop before I get mown down by my own guns. So. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're going to swap that out. That's terrible. It's like, cool, it's an auto shotty, but it's got five shots in it. It's like, <laughs> that's terrible. Let's put that in. Instead. Oh, no, yeah, they are both. They are both spawning. And then they're going to should get stuck on both the sets of barbed wire. Someone get. Okay. Is that that one going? Wave completed. Next 15 seconds. Oh no. Okay, yeah, so the waves are kind of out of sync because we've got one dummy over here. Yeah, the guns didn't turn around and shoot. Alright, well, we've got the next wave coming in. I guess that, oh, well, that does mean we've only got one of these guys. I'll take that. Um, I kind of want to run out there and grab that, but... Yeah, the waves are all kind of out of sync now, aren't they? Yeah, because that now is the next way, yeah... Yeah, all of the waves have gone out of sync because that one ran through. And it's like I can't go out there and loot those big guys because the guns are just going to shoot me down. Don't climb on the barbed wire, you fool. Go, 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 go. There we go, we got one. Oof. That was close. Let's throw a molly. That kind of helped speed the killing. Just try and grab that last one. Oh god! Come on. We 
Go, 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 go. All right, that worked out all right. Is that continuing? Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Whoa. That's a lot of big guys. All right. Molotov. Oh! There's a big guy down there now. All right, I'm gonna have to jump down and hopefully we can kind of cheese him a little bit. You gonna shoot at him? I have to just shoot him through the magical door. Yeah, we're totally, oh no, no, no. There's still another guy there. Alright, well we can at least loot this guy. Right, let's gonna drop some of that stuff off. Cause um that's why I put this box here. Let's chuck as much of that as we can in there. There we go. Probably like three rows of barbed wire or something. Probably what we want. But the guns are, yeah, they're all still there. doing any shooting, isn't it? Yeah, I really want to go and get the big guys, if nothing else, but yeah. Alright, I'm going to jump down like an idiot. Oh! Run! Oh my god! Uh, uh, open the door! Open the door! Oh, I climbed over it! <laughs> I'll take that. I will take that. I don't know how that happened, but I, I'll take it. Oh, that one's finished. That one's still got somebody to go. So is there someone, someone still alive there? Sorry, I just leant forward and headbutted my microphone. Um, oh, I think there's still somebody down there. Come on. Just kill that last one off. All right, that's got to be the last wave now. Yeah, there we go. But yeah, yeah. Well, you know, we'll we should do it one at a time. But I kind of think it three next time for the why nots. But there you go. Uh, oh, I'm out of mummies. There we go. Yeah. Cool. Right, let's get out there. Let's grab all of the loot that we can. I mean, nothing fantastic in there, to be honest, is there really? Grab that. And let's drop our gun. And then we'll drop a bunch of stuff in here. Yeah, nothing 
Nothing amazing in there, is there really? I mean, I've already got one of those. Yeah. It's a little bit meh, in my opinion. But there we go. I could probably bring another one of these out, actually. Yeah, let's go and quickly do that. Right, there we go. Let's go and see what we got from the beacons before we do anything else. Um, let's go and grab all that. Oh, that's like one of those legendary backpacks, I think. Shotgun. Got a turret. That's pretty good. Huh. Alright, that second one was a bit of a dud, wasn't it? I mean, that's all stuff we've got, but cool. But, yeah, we've already got it. Um, yeah. It's a bit of a shame. And then let's start just looting up these as much as we can. Uh, let's grab the big fellas. As that's where the good stuff is. Let's go and drop all that stuff off, actually, because we're kind of cucumbered already, aren't we? Um, yeah, it didn't really work that well, but, um, you know... It was it was fun. You got to try these things for science. As a ooh, an all access key card. Ooh, any bunkers still oh, first have first in inventory. Ooh, hello. All right, that's interesting. So that opens any but ooh. Nice. Uh, let's grab these big guys. Grab all of those. That's actually pretty cool. We got a all access key card. I'll take that. It's pretty good. Uh, another row of barbed wires. I think wouldn't go amiss. And then it's just search through this for ammo. I think really like that. Yeah, this is a treasure trove of ammo, really, isn't it? If you get the guns to do the killing. And then it's like, I'm not really using the shotguns, so might as well use them for these hordes. And just kind of mow them down with a shotgun. But, yeah, not doing too bad. Okay, I mean, wasn't perfect, but I'll take it. Um, and then I'm just going to grab all of this loot here. Okay, let's just grab all of that. Is that one? No, that was the other guy, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I'm not exactly sure how I got over that gate because I thought I was screwed, but um, there you go. <laughs> I somehow managed to climb over it, and I will take that. Uh, oh man, 308's doing well, isn't it? Kind of want the 556 and the 762, really. 556, probably if I'm. There. Ooh. Oh, is this a big fella? This must be a big fella. Ah, yeah, undead boss. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's one of those guys mixed up in here. Um, oh, no, no, no. Oh, they did take a bit of... Did they take any damage? That one took some damage. The rest of them look fine. Oh, that one took a lot of damage. The rest of them don't look too bad, though, do they? Considering... I mean, they all took a bit of damage, but... Nowhere near as much as I thought they were going to take. Uh, that's good. I don't want to drive away and uh, drop this stuff off. But I'll go and sell it. Because uh, a lot of this I'm just going to sell. But um, I don't want to do that because uh, these bodies might despawn. So I want to just try and get as much of this as we can. Um, so let's go. I think I've got another one of those. Let's go and grab another one. Okay, there we go. I've just dropped another one. I'll just put it outside this time because it kind of makes sense. But I think I've got most of these. Um, yeah, another row of barbed wire. Oh no, still more. When you think you got them all, no you haven't. Um, but I think another row of barbed wire. Because they get stuck on the one. And then they get stuck on the next one straight after it. And then straight after it and so on. Um, the guns are good. But they are a bit of an issue in terms of trying to get out there and loot. I don't know what the solution to that would be. Are we going to be a decent amount of that 300 ammo? Oh, wow. All right, let's grab all of that. Because a lot of this stuff is just going to get sold because I just really don't need it anymore. Um, but, yeah, let's grab that. So many bodies on top of bodies. It's just 
crazy. Uh, there we go. Yeah, I do need a lot of five five six, so that is a that is a good thing. I think I've got most of it. Nope. Whenever I think I've got most of it, I don't. But yeah, there we go. I think that's good. Uh, but it's starting to get dark, so I think this is where I'm going to call it, and I'll end the episode. I'm just going to carry on uh, looting. Um, I think we got all the juicy stuff. Yeah, I think we got all the juicy stuff, so that's fine. And then it's mostly just going to be ammo from these guys. So, so I think that's what we want to get. But yeah, we probably missed out on ammo, but yeah, you know, it was fun. Uh, once they got out, it was all right until they got out of sync. And then I was kind of hoping putting the guns there would mean they'd swivel round and shoot each shoot the ones that were on the wall. But uh, maybe we need one stepped back or something uh, like that. Um, but yeah, I was kind of hoping that they would shoot those ones, but uh, it didn't happen, unfortunately. But there we go. A lot of red eyes glowing as well. Interesting. Uh, there we are. Uh, that's good. Uh, but yeah, as I say, I think for now, I think this is where we'll call it and we'll end the episode. So for either one, please give me a thumbs up, comment your thoughts down below, subscribe for more. I really do appreciate it. Stay safe out there, everyone, and I'll catch you next time.